what is going on people it's bobby and welcome to our first test drive unlimited solar crown video on the channel for this series we're just going to be playing through the game seeing what it's got to offer um i did originally have it pre-ordered but then after it seemed like it was going to have some issues and stuff i got rid of my pre-order um and that seemed to be a good decision because there's a lot of server issues and things at the start i'm hoping those have been somewhat fixed by now so yeah we're just going to take the game as it comes try and have some fun and hopefully it's a good test drive game. Let's get into it. This is a message from Radiant Corporation, the organizers of the new edition of the Solar Crown. A motorsports event that celebrates prestige and excellence. We're currently seeking new participants, and your profile caught our attention. We're therefore inviting you to enter the selection races for this event. The Solar Crown is a chance for you to win the hearts of the public and make a name for yourself. We have selected Hong Kong Island for the new edition. It is an island of many faces, alternating between city streets, beaches, and lush jungles. You'll need to show off your skills behind the wheel of stunning cars. Do you have what it takes to become the new star of the Solar Crown? I'll show you around the island myself. Okay, so this is Test Drive Unlimited. It's taken there are lots of quite a few attempts to actually even get into the game, to be honest. But hopefully we can get a little bit of a play session going before it inevitably disconnects us. Like you, their performances have impressed enough I'm assuming here we're just driving to the first race. But there aren't many places. I have heard that the game is um, not quite a test drive game. It's more focused on the racing than it is on the cars and the driving. Those are the spectators. Like the That's social aspect. Impress. Grabbing the attention of the spectators is what helps you progress in the competition. Reputation is everything in the Solar Crown. Your access is determined by how much interest you attract among our guests. The tournament is at the core of the Solar Crown. If you win the spectators' approval, you'll win too. It's annoying me that we have to go so slow following her. Like, why doesn't she speed up? Have you heard about the Solar Crown clans? No. The recruiters are here to watch the selection process. The clans are made up of the Solar Crown's wealthiest participants. If you join one of them, you're sure to go far. The Sharps are as ruthless in business as they are behind the wheel. They're all about high expectations, luxury, and ambition. As for the streets, they're all about making an impression and mixing styles. They're bold and have a no-holds-barred mentality, especially on the road. They'll certainly attract attention in the competition and in the media. I'm sure they'll approach you given your potential. Your illness is fully configured. Okay, show me what you can do behind the wheel. Are we about to be allowed to race? Oh, let's go. Oh, I can't. Whoa, I can't pause. I can't pause. I want to check the driving aids. Make sure there's not got like auto brake on or some nonsense. At least the racing line's like super obvious. Okay, complete the race against Vivian. Complete well the race done. against Vivian. You didn't disappoint me. You were impressed. Okay, first race. Let's see what this is saying. Apparently, the um, there's no like you don't have to win to progress. Whoa! Didn't even accelerate off the start there. But the other drivers are a novice. Yes, they are because we're already gone. Oh my God! What? Oh, 
Oh, sh sugar. The handler model is stiff. It's stiff. That'll be that'll take some getting used to. Okay, that Ferrari is rapid. Out the way, sucker. Yeah, that the handling is horrible. It feels like a boat. It feels like I'm driving a boat. Or like a front wheel drive car. Like the the initial turning is real sharp and then everything else after that is just lacking. It feels like you're driving a front wheel drive car. Which that clearly isn't since the Lamborghini Huracan. Right, level up rep for the first time. That's the first race anyway, we did win it, but we've learned a few things there. We're definitely gonna have to get used to the handling model if it's it's horrible. Or well, on first impressions it's horrible. Maybe it's just that car, but that was horrible. Our reps leveled up. Okay, rep level two. You have increased your reputation. Congratulations. Your reputation is extremely important in the solar crown. Like the initial turning is like super sharp. It's like, basically it feels, just feels like the game wants you to drift around everything and not like actually drive and hit corners and apexes. Right, okay, where's this next race? We'll do this one and then we'll um, we'll call it a a day there. Essentially, it's taken us that long to get into the... Well, we might call it a day. Let's see. I'm, this one, I'm assuming this is not our actual like starting car, so... What's that? Headlights, wipers. Oh, okay. See there? Like, I'm turning in. And it just stopped turning. Um, and I wasn't particularly doing a high speed like a hurricane wouldn't like understeer there in that in that scenario like it sounds nice. Oh god, sneaks up on you, doesn't it? Right. Final selection race. I'm assuming maybe we will get a starter car after this. Yeah, that, that handling model, it's, it's really, it's its taking me aback a little bit. We'll get used to it. We'll get used to it. it won't take us that long. Right, we need to go into the back of this McLaren the first time, so let's make sure we don't do that again. The brakes on that Ferrari are sharp, I'll say that. I think maybe I'm following the line a little bit too much as well. Like, I should probably, like, do my own thing a little bit. Like there, just cut that. Rather than trying to go around it. I am noticing that the... The scenery slows you down a lot, like so. I think it is going to be geared towards like being accurate on the track. Well, I'll say the track on the road. Right, this is quite sharp. This one, so we're going to over break. We well, we did not over break. That's going to lose us a lot of time. So just, um, I don't know to I don't know to describe the feeling I'm getting from it. Maybe it's this car. I'm hoping it's just this car and it just handles horrendously. 
it just feels like a boat. Like. Like there, I should be able to accelerate all the way through that, but I know for a fact if I accelerate in this car through that there, I'll just shoot out to the right. But, we, you know, we got through it. It's only on novice at the end of the day, so... But yeah, that, that really is going to take some getting used to, that, that handler model is really going to take some getting used to. I've played worse, but... Yeah, it's a bit... Um... It's clunky. That's the best way I can put it. It's clunky. Five hundred meters high, one hundred and twenty floors. We are now at the top of the Solar Hotel. It is the highest building in Hong Kong and was built specially for the competition. But that's not even scratching the surface. The Solar Crown is much more than a competition. It's a new perspective on the world. Good. I have an urgent matter to sort out. Take the elevator. It will take you directly to your suite. And for anything else, Ellis will be more than happy to guide you. Welcome to your room. The Solar Crown ensures every participant has one. I'm Ellis. I will help you manage your racing schedule from the information panel in your room. I will also help you organize your activities. By the way, Miss Hughes is waiting for you at the dealership. Take the elevator right, so and go to the hotel. We just arrived at our room. The Let's um... will drive you to the dealership. Oh, this is a annoying me. I might turn that off. Let's have a little look around, just to see what we've got here. So we've got the, well, daily challenges will be there. Really have to look at that at the moment. The wardrobe, have we, have we got anything else we can put on? Probably not. Some glasses, let's get them on. Let's go with the, let's go with the red. Should we go to, let's go with the rain jacket actually. Black pants or jeans? Let's go jeans. Why not? Why not? Um, let's go plain black. And then yeah, so, okay, so let's just, we'll, we'll chill with that. Not that we can actually see our character anyway. Like, is there a way to change that? No, apparently not. But yeah, there it is. That is the start of um, Test Drive Unlimited Solar Crown. It took us a while to get in. Since since we've got in touch wood, we haven't actually been kicked out since. So, first two races, very easy to win. But the handling model seems a little bit off. That's going to take some time. Hopefully, we'll get used to that within the next few races but yeah see you in the next episode peace